Hello, this is Haku the Bean, and today we are going to be tumbling again. If you like this video, please leave a like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. Let's get right into this. I'm a lesbian. 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 Girls. <laughs> she had a hard time. NASA. We used to have nine planets, but we now only have eight. Pluto, stop telling everyone I'm not a planet. Sometimes we could still hear its voice. Look, I'm not saying that the voting a planet named after the Roman god that stoked his rage and brought down and on as his vengeful oh, of fury and re retribution, but gestures and everything. <laughs> Final that e an explanation. I'm guessing I'm gonna just assume something and and assume it this way because it's funnier this way. Minecraft YouTube Uber fix is crazy because you'll be reading the most devastating, distressing, in life altering angst and the character we named the Mumbo Jumbo. This reads like a glove shit of us, but it isn't. I haven't read that angst about Mumbo or Jumbo. It also had his friend Evil. Oh, you have read the angst about Mumbo Jumbo. It also has his friend Evil Oxizuma in it, who is the evil version of a guy named Zixuma. I'm reblogging this for myself because, God, I'm running out of oxygen the way I am cackling. I don't know. Hey, we saw you from across the bar. Here's one piece of our one piece these exclusives. Here is from here, Thursday. Netflix, I don't think you understand the implications of this. Oh, they do. They do. Oh, I can't read. <sighs> the current chess grandmaster, Magnus Carlsen, intends to replace non book inaccuracies during opening. Moves he knows aren't the best, forced to game into a non book position at ASAP. So his opponents will have to think for themselves instead of going by memorized opening theory. So, play like a noob. Got it. You're joking, but it actually is a popular theory in chess that a complete noob potentially can be the master by confusing them as a noob but doesn't know what they're doing. The master is unable to recognize which of uh, valid strategies they're pursuing and cannot deploy for proper counter strategy. Chess masters when their opponent it doesn't make one of the five approved optimal opening moves. You can't do this to me. You should do shit like this when we fans. For real though, a newbie is way more of an issue than a master because of what are you doing? I'm currently a fencing coach for a high school club and my Lisa's playing fence and routine beats kids who have been fencing for five to six years because he's just so unpredictable and messy that his opponents have no idea what to do. I know what a master is doing. I just may not be faster than them. 
I know I'm faster than a newbie, but hey, what the fuck is happening? I have, on rare occasions, won Pokemon battles like this. I have no idea what the meta is. Oh, same. And just slap together things. Just, just slap things together that sound cool. It's fun when you win by taking someone completely off guard because who would run that? I don't know, man. The noob who, that just kicked your ass. I'm not smart enough for all these mind games that go into serious competitive Pokemon, but I do know. Big laser go pew. Big laser do go pew. That is very true. Big laser go pew. It would be kind of cool if Hollywood being shut down had a side effect, besides hopefully getting everyone better working conditions, of course, of getting uh, some non-US movies and shows a bit more of a platform again outside the US. Because why the heck is there like mostly only Hollywood in much of the world? I love the track called the US Imperialism has some pop culture. It's great. Did I just say chuckled instead of uh, chokehold? That is... okay. This also goes out to everyone being like, Well, there'll be no, no movies and no shows. What am I going to watch? Like, girly, this is a US strike. You have a whole world's worth of really good... Of really freaking good entertainment to watch. You're missing out. Get out of your comfort zone. Watch some weird-ass local European movie with questionable subs. Go watch that Thai TV drama. This is a perfect excuse to check out anime if you consider it a cringe so far. This is the whole world of Bollywood too, and there's so much stuff I don't even know about that's out there. Just waiting for you to watch it. And Lorelei, I don't know what that word means. Oh yeah, good riddance to Hollywood. Ugh. <sighs> So we're we'll talking about Muppet adaptations of classic literary works. Someone jokingly suggested Neil Gaiman and Sandman on the grounds that due to the World Fantasy Award fiasco, it technically qualifies as literature. And I just can't get the idea out of my head. And if they followed the, pre the pattern of previous Muppet adaptations, they'd be obliged to put Kermit the Frog in some prominent role, and every conceivable option is objectively hilarious. Sorry to reply, but I wanted to elaborate here. I like the idea of playing Kermit as Morpheus. Think about it, he's a busy showrunner who's trying to put on a good performance for people while the rest of his cast and crew are go oofballs, if not whole morons. Sometimes he's just as silly as they are. Simmons' realm is kind of like the Muppet show, except with less humor and more melancholy soul-searching. Kermit would be a great Morpheus, and Miss Pink could play the role of a of jilted lover, as she often does, because Morpheus always he's has one of those too. And you could have Settler and Waldorf as Kate and Abel. Oh my goodness. I don't know what uh, this movie even is. Scooter or Skeeter as Lucien and, and Lucien. Uncle Deadly as Goldie. I just want to make Robin death since he's related to Kermit and a gentle soul at heart who enjoys being other people. Death being absolutely serious but absolutely tiny appeals for me for some reason. Ernie as a Zyre. Bert as despair. Oh my goodness. Perfect. It's not easy being a dream. I'm not doing the current voice. I just can't. <laughs> uh. 
I think we're video game nerd has a King of the Hill character. I tell you, what were they thinking? <sighs> Baldur's Gate modders chatified Asterian. Oh, they did. Holy crap. Welcome to the Weather Institute. There seems to be some kind of terrorism on the second floor. Look, her shift ends in five minutes. It's neither her fault nor her problem that there's some kind of terrorism on the second floor. She does not care. That looks like a takes more than five minutes to, to solve kind of problem. That's someone else's problem. Namely, yours. Love this. Namely, yours. It's your freaking problem now, player. What the heck is up with Bo- or soy? Hey, by the way, the these fuckers are never just doing dog shit. Those things don't play fetch or bark at the postman. They're always uh, looming or being foreboding or predicting the exact date of your death or some shit. Poor boy, or toy. Why can't they just be a dog? Enough crack ships. What's your crack fight? What unrelated characters do you want to see fight to the death? God of War and... I think that's a Bleach character? I'm not zooming in to find out. <laughs> My teacher. You can't use Wikipedia as a source. It's not reliable. First of all, Wikipedia is actually more reliable than uh, a lot of the sources that your teachers will suggest to you. Just simply because we uh, uh, exist solely on the basis of a freaking... <laughs> on freaking, um, actually... It literally exists on nerds correcting each other. We uh, exist solely on the basis of... Um, actually... The Titanic was uh, is, uh, 17 in, in feet and 18 inches, not 19 inches. Because nerds will get that pedantic, and I know I got the, the length of the Titanic wrong, I don't care, I didn't read that freaking article. <sighs> anyway. My teacher, you can't use Wikipedia as a source. It's not reliable. Me who had Carl's Marx anime article to say he was into war and had to change back within 10 minutes. Chaos control! Wrong picture! Wrong picture! Wrong picture! Oh. That's beautiful. Too bad I can't open that because that's a spoiler. For something. Please elect and payment method. Credit card. Octopus. Cephalopods can be exchanged for goods and services. There are many benefits to being a marine biologist. <laughs> Cephalopods can be exchanged for goods and services. Tom Foolery. Oh, it got a little bit low in the 90s, but after 2000, Tom Foolery is at an all time high. I don't know. I don't think it's that high. We are so fucking back, baby. Oh. 
<sighs> well, Fra Alan Louis, as you are no doubt aware, nobody quite knows just how cats can get in one's stomach, but nevertheless, I feared that operation is inevitable. Frelin Bingo, please put the patient to sleep so we can proceed. Gosh, like crossing over my two favorite things, don't mind me. Anyway, Blue would have so much fun with the medic because Meg would let her have unlimited stick and pokies, and Meg doesn't have a medical license but does have a wild imagination. I think they have the most fun games, games of clinic where they, of course, both forget to put their patients under. <laughs> <sighs> the morning dew perfectly captured my dog's erratic freedom run. Neom! Look at him go. That's adorable. Like us still up there. Not her body, sure, but her soul is. I saw it through my telescope one night, but I was looking for aliens. She was sniffing for table scraps under Saren's ring. She chases comets and bites down on satellites. I saw her napping by Neptune. She was kicking her feet, passing through the Oort cloud. Oh, it's like the stroke of a, of a hand on her earth. As like marbles in four little halls like flames, she bobs through Jupiter's moons like cold old Moscow streets. Up there, the stars are a great big field, and look, she's running so fast. God damn. Look at her go. A dog in space. I think it's a dog that rushes in into space. Hmm. Straight people know that you're supposed to like your partner, right? Like, enjoy them as another human being? There are times I seriously wonder. A lot of straight hey, women don't know that, to be honest. They know the man is supposed to enjoy them, but they don't often consider what they want, and when they do, they usually stick to preferences they can choose, like participating in the subculture together, rather than the man's actual personal qualities. The boy for how he treats her own is only as how, I guess how the men around her have treated her for her whole life, and men don't treat women very well at all. And a lot of, people, and a lot of women don't know that. There is a lot of pressure to just give, to just give him a chance, and Appreciate the fact that he likes you, as a man's interest is something valuable. Ding ding ding, we have a winner! <laughs> oh. This one's gonna need a little bit of a zoomy. No, I just wanted to zoom in on that. Things on my grandpa's dirt road farm that was actually pretty creepy in hindsight. There was always a specific spot where anything mechanical would shut down. Cars would saw and the four-wheeler would cut off. A graveyard that didn't belong to our family sat beside the home. We don't know the names on the gravestones. There was a skeleton in the forest. We don't know who passed there. A home at the beginning of the road burned down, but the chimney remained. I swear we could see smoke coming from it sometimes. There were figures in the wheat fields. Sometimes, but they were too far away to see. Grandpa said they were neighbors, and we should never talk to them.
My great grandma's house sits next to my grandpa's. Abandoned. And we were told to never go in there. Sometimes at night when I couldn't sleep, I could hear the sound of clacking coming down the road. Grandpa's farm gothic. This is just American gothic. American Gothic. I don't know, um, a lot of the, um... Hang on. One Piece, No Way Home. I don't get it. Anyway, a lot of, um, old farms are a little bit creepy to me. What does that mean? What's this about? <sighs> I'm like a romanceable NPC. If you can't let me once per day for a week straight, you unlock the dialogue option to marry me. Throw my favorite food at me five times and I will approach you and tell you I love you. Oh. Who's just a little boy? Tell me! I will have you load if it's the last thing I do. So wife, I wants to play games, huh? And I have to check on something. I think my I, um, Wi-Fi is a little bit messy. Anyway. Did you know that Kirby is capable of speaking in full, terms, in full senses that the players preview to in the pause screen text of Amazing Mirror, Squeak Squad, and Nightmare in Dreamland? And it would do you well to listen to his infinite wisdom. Also, in most games, the pause screen text for the sleep ability is written in the first first person. Can you show us his wisdom? Sleep. Do not disturb. I need my beauty rest. Parasol. The sun shines in this parasol of mine. Where I walk, enemies balk. I float gently down. Wheel. I ride like the, the wind. Fast. Too fast. Tornado. Spin, 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 spin. Ah! <laughs> Spark. Bzz. 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 Laser. Light. Inflammation. And by stimulated emission of radiation. And ricochets off heel too. Beam. It seems like a... A whip. Beam it. Burning. Flaming tackle time. Who's gonna stop me? Kirby Wisdom. I hope you didn't do this for... Thanks. We have to reload the page now because my Wi-Fi decided to crap on me. I think it's still a little bit crappy. It seemed better than it was, but like... 
It's really laggy right now. Don't worry, we're getting there. We are getting there. I swear we're gonna get there eventually. We got there. Friends, we got there. Oh, gosh, dang it. Never mind, we have to do this now. Seventy percent profits that I worked all month to get. Gone in one trade. Owned. Don't be happy when someone else owes uh, when someone loses. Be happy when everyone wins. Make it lose on every trade you make. Ache. Did you just cast a stockbroker curse on me, you freak? Yes, I did. From a day on, you will lose on most of your trades. Spell will be broken once you accept your once I accept your apology. I reverse the curse, and may your destitution be permanent. May all your decisions be as poor as today's. Just watch and see how your trades will do from today on. By Allah, may your portfolio crumble into dust. <laughs> oh my goodness, it's a magic battle. It's a magic Wall Street battle. Love, love, love the casual use of by Allah. As a damage multiplier. Ah <laughs> oh, yes, a very satisfying noise. <sighs> I like when visual novels fight for their life to make an anime opening. While throwing their PNGs around the screen like dolls. I think we've seen this before. But it's always worth another er, er, look. Believe me. This is always beautiful. Um, your bra strap is showing. I thought this was me at first, and I was really confused. OMG, hi! We're multiplying. Oh, no, we haven't seen this one before. Uh. Hey! Hang on. Dang. They're like one, two, three, four, five, six. I don't know, six tuplets? I don't know if that's a word. Oh, this one is broken, broken. What's your favorite drink? Water, coffee, tea. Vanilla extract, soda, juice, alcohol, something else. I'm sorry, but you know it's broken for one reason. Everyone clicked on vanilla extract, and it's only 9.2%, while every other option is 8.8%. 8 so this one is broken, broken. Because we know Tumblr's favorite anything is always going to be vanilla extract.
I don't even know if this one's gonna be any good. I'm ready to spend the weekend looking for the most justified Trump mugshot out there. <laughs> okay. They really tried. Can you do better? Trump would be such a good drag queen. Like, just such an, an unbelievable and incredibly, incredible and talented drag queen. It's such a bummer that he's decided to be a fascist and a threat to democracy because that bitch wanted to devour at the house of yes. Such a loss. His cadence, his tiny bit itchy hand dressers, his crappy little nicknames of people that are insane but somehow stick to your brain. The problem with it's Ron DeSant and Antimonius is that, that he needs a personality he transplant. And those are not yet available. If he had laid the garbage fire all of his soul all aside for a wig and heels back in the 80s, we'd live in a better world. What a clinically insane yet correct take. No context. Jin Embe Idoodle. Why on earth did you say that? I think this might be a little bit in of a funny context with the previous post. Even though it's not supposed to have any context. Pronouns? Yeah, I got all the pronouns you could want. Bootleg? Nah, nah, you got all wrong. They just, uh, fell off the back of a trunk. Ugh. Now can, now can I interest you in a she, sir? Or how about a nice he, he? That one's gonna get real popular, let me tell you what. I'm telling you these are genuine articles of speech. Look, kid, I don't really do this, but you buy a set of, uh, let me see, not those. Uh, you use, I'll throw another pair free. I don't know, for your dog or something. You ever think about are your dog's pronouns? I thought not. Cash only. That is something that Stan would say. <laughs> Today I learned that hard disks are so sensitive to vibration that just screaming at them diminishes their, def or their performance. Yeah, getting screamed at diminishes my performance too. You ain't special. Reblog if getting screamed at diminishes your performance. Fine, I'll zoom in. Listen up, Fives. A 10 is speaking. I just wanted to tell you guys that I really respect you all. I mean, it must take a lot of guts to go crawling over to the guy as you yield to, right? Not that winner would like me, would really understand the mentality, but still. I do the guy that I mentored in the other day. Could, and someone tell me what he said? I can't hear. You're up here. This person just speaks in a evil Cree article that I'm not going to try to read because that is way too small of text. <laughs> Rent free. He's got a wild line for the Lost Belt Kings. I'm gonna now zoom out.
banned from querymap.com for attempting to tag each stretch of highway where I popped up of target at the sight of a passing a driver's truck nuts and those lady he crushed with the slutty eyelashes. What well, vehicle has both? I listened to a podcast interview with you once where you paused mid-conversation to take a call from a prospective job and came back to tell the host you didn't get it. The human pet guy strikes again. Who's the human pet guy? What? I'm convinced everyone who hates this show only watches it through out of context clips with inflammatory descriptions on YouTube. The Adventures with Superman? I don't think I've ever seen it, so. I don't really know what the show is about in any context. I don't really keep up with the comic book characters, so. Question! Obachi, please give us a ranking of who's the best drinker among the Straw Hats. I know it's been said that Toro and Nami, he can drink ink a lot, but what about the others? Oda 1, Jimba 1, Jimba, Jinbei 2, Zoro 3, Nami 3, Frankie E5, Sanji 6, Robin 7, Grook 8, Oh no, Jinbei's one first. Zoro, Nami, Frankie, Sanji, Robin, Brooke, Yusuf, Luffy, then Chopper. The sexual tension between two gas stations on the same intersection. I'm so sick of this crap! Two gas stations can't even be on the same block without some walnut shipping them while I can't find a single fic for De any Eastern Applebee's with Denny's bottoming. You're literally out of your mind if you think Denny's isn't a top. I wish the 2012 apocalypse actually happened. Man, that would kind of suck. Anyway. <sighs> Scrappy dude has been found dead in Miami. Is he okay? He's alright, but he died. Yeah, he's just dead, you know. That's fine. Found footage horror movie, but instead of the monster attacking the crew, it just steals the camera and the rest of the film is the crew chasing the monster to get the camera back. OP, your mind. <laughs> what the? I need to check something. Hmm. Dream of a Simpsons hit run remake published by TD Inc. <laughs> I dreamt last night that a PS5 remix of Simpsons Hit and Run finally came out, but the catch was that it was published by TD Bank. When I purchased the game and brought it home, I opened the case and found that in order to actually play the game, I had to fill in the application for the TD Rewards card, credit card that came in the case and mailed it off to TD. 
Then after two weeks, I received both my new credit card and a code to actually activate and launch a game I purchased in the mail. Having no choice, I filled out the application, waited two weeks, and received my new credit card. That I immediately ignored as I have no interest or use for it. And wasn't a TD customer. And the activation pro code for Simpsons hit run PS5. I used the code and began playing. The game was really good. I especially liked to have the feedback whenever I drove over a coat or on the road. It actually felt like, like that was happening to the controller and into my hands. Driving over a pothole even gave my hands quite the jolt. When Homer was hungry, the controller vibrated and rumbled. I played the first few missions and really enjoyed it. Also, the game added a feature where bike could properly skateboard in addition to using vehicles so you could play an actually good mini version of Tony Hawk Pro Skater when playing as Bart. That is an interesting dream. <sighs> it is a phase, Mom. Show me permanent save the self, Mom. Impermanence does not mean insignificance, Mom. The key to half your life is being in a constant state of change and acceptance, Mom. Good parenting means being able to accept and connect with your kid through all the, the different stages of their life, Mom. <laughs> Mom. <laughs> I told the Hibachi guy to make me regret being bored when he asked how sp ACA1 my chick, my spicy chicken, and he just nods solemnly. I'll see you all in Valhalla. I'm seeing dead prophets. They weren't lying. That chicken can kill you. It tastes really good, though. My confidence is a chef. Two asexuals in a tree. S I T T I N G. Please call the fire department. We are stuck. Oh, I think that's the end of the video, actually. Oh my goodness. We've been recording for about 45 minutes. If you like this video, please leave a like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. I have no idea what I'm going to be doing tomorrow, so until then, goodbye!